Wow, just in time. You saw the show? <laughs> Ooh, bombs bursting everywhere. But not really. No boom. Just a bomb, no boom. They, they forgot the boom. So, I guess I got to pat myself on the back. August 12, August 13, August 15. I put out three pieces, false flags before the election. And um, I guess this looks like this looks like we were what we were expecting, right? What better way? Look at the names. Everybody got a bomb. George Soros, <laughs> Hillary Clinton, Debbie Wasserman Schultz, Obama, CNN, Cuomo. I'm in New York right now, and you can hear the sirens. Big deal, right? Nobody got hurt. <laughs> it's time to lock everybody down. Though. You gotta be careful. Oh, you gotta be careful. Watch out. Watch out. It's conquer and divide, right? It's a distraction. The great distraction. Who did it? Oh, the way of distraction. Who did it? We're gonna spend the next 14 days trying to figure out who did it, right? While the incumbents sweep the election. Ah, American politics. Love it. What a great play. Am I being cynical? I don't know. Nobody got hurt. The bombs didn't even get where they were supposed to go. They didn't even make it to the steps. <laughs> Come on. Come on, people. Come on, people now. What's going on? So, bombs were mailed all across the country. They said it was come from everybody's reporting. They're, they seem to have a similarity. All the bombs have a similarity. They're similar. They came from the same place. So, it's only a few hours after. They didn't find anybody with the bomb on Monday with Soros. But now there's multiple bombs. So, we'll see how fast they round them up. Who's behind it? Ah, take your bets. Let's take our bets. Who's behind it? Oh, big, the big, <laughs> big false flags. Gotta watch that. Big distraction. What are they covering? 435. Ah, all the Congress seats are up for grabs. Right? All but 35 Senate seats. Up for grabs. Right? They're getting desperate. Oligarchy's getting desperate, de desperate for power. Look at the targets. CNN. Soros. Clinton. Obama. My name is Marcus Conti reporting.